Anna Neagle, a distinguished actress whose career spans a plethora of notable works, has left an indelible mark on the cinematic landscape. One may ponder which among her legendary performances truly defined her career, or alternatively, which work holds a special place in the hearts of her admirers. The breadth of Neagle's repertoire, from stage to screen, offers a rich tapestry of roles that showcase her versatility and enduring talent. As we reflect on the legacy of this classic Hollywood actor, we invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences related to Anna Neagle in the comments below. Your stories add depth to the appreciation of a remarkable artist who has undoubtedly left an enduring imprint on the world of entertainment. In the enchanting realm of cinema's golden age, a luminary emerged, leaving an indelible mark on the silver screen. Anna Neagle, a name synonymous with grace and talent, graced the film industry with her captivating presence. Beyond the spotlight, Neagle's journey unfolds as a riveting tale of resilience and artistic brilliance. Born in London, Neagle's early foray into the world of entertainment began on the stage, where her effervescent charm and magnetic stage presence became the talk of the town. Her transition from the theatrical boards to the cinematic frame was seamless, propelling her into the echelons of British cinema's leading ladies. Neagle's career burgeoned during the tumultuous years of World War II, where her on-screen portrayals served as a beacon of hope and inspiration for a nation grappling with uncertainty. Not merely confined to the whims of Hollywood, she carved a niche for herself in the British film industry, becoming an iconic figure during a pivotal era. Behind the scenes, Anna Neagle was not merely an actress, but a trailblazer. In an era dominated by gender norms, she dared to produce and direct, defying conventions and establishing herself as a force to be reckoned with. Her directorial ventures showcased a nuanced understanding of storytelling echoing her multifaceted talents. It wasn't just the glamour of the silver screen that captivated Neagle, her heart beat for a patriotic cause. During the war, she devoted herself to entertaining the troops, proving that her commitment to the art of cinema was as profound as her dedication to uplifting the spirits of those on the front lines. Among her myriad accomplishments, one must not overlook Neagle's penchant for historical roles. Her portrayals of iconic historical figures added depth to her repertoire, transforming her into a versatile actress capable of breathing life into characters across time periods. As the curtains fell on her illustrious career, Anna Neagle's legacy endured, transcending the ephemeral blow of the film reel. Her contributions to the cinematic tapestry and her unwavering spirit have left an indelible imprint on the annals of entertainment history. In the grand symphony of Hollywood's yesteryears, Anna Neagle's star shines brightly, a testament to the enduring power of talent, tenacity, and a touch of enchantment. Her life and career stand as a captivating chapter in the narrative of cinema, a chapter written with elegance and brought to life by a truly remarkable artist. Portraying Queen Victoria three times on screen, Anna Neagle solidified her mark in cinematic history. From the regal demeanor in Victoria the Great to the dreamy sequences in Lilacs in the Spring, her versatile portrayal of the iconic monarch showcased her acting prowess. Interestingly, in 60 glorious years, she brought Queen Victoria to life yet again, illustrating Neagle's enduring connection with historical roles. Beyond the royal court, Neagle displayed her acting range by taking on the character of Nell Gwynn not once, but twice first in Nell Gwynn, and later in Let's Make Up. The latter film holds an intriguing detail. Despite playing Errol Flynn's daughter, Neagle was almost five years his senior in real life, a testament to her timeless charm. This dual role as Queen Victoria and Nell Gwynn exemplifies Neagle's ability to seamlessly transition between historical eras, showcasing a depth that extended beyond the glitz of Hollywood. Her knack for embodying characters across time periods added a unique dimension to her career, making her a standout figure in the annals of film history. In her cinematic journey, Anna Neagle not only graced the screen but also defied conventions behind the scenes. As an actress who dared to produce and direct, she left an indelible legacy in an era dominated by gender norms. Neagle's impact on the silver screen transcends the roles she played, marking her as a trailblazer in the grand narrative of cinema. Anna Neagle, a luminary of the silver screen, left an indelible mark on the cinematic world. Beyond her iconic roles, she received the Daily Mail National Film Award for Spring in Park Lane, a testament to her recognition in the industry. 
Neagle's impact extended beyond accolades. She ventured into production and direction, breaking gender norms. Her versatility shone through in portraying Queen Victoria thrice on screen, cementing her in cinematic history. From the regal demeanor in Victoria the Great to the dreamy sequences in Lilacs in the Spring, Neagle showcased her acting prowess. An intriguing detail in Let's Make Up adds a layer to her timeless charm, playing Errol Flynn's daughter despite being senior in real life. In her cinematic journey, Neagle not only graced the screen but defied conventions. Her legacy endures, marked by a memorial service at Westminster Abbey on the 20th of October 1986. As the great aunt of Nicholas Holt, Neagle's influence extends through generations, solidifying her as a trailblazer in the grand narrative of cinema. For seven consecutive years post-WWII, Anna Neagle held the title of England's favorite actress. Her journey, beginning with a stage debut at age 12 in 1917, resurfaced in 1925 with the musical review Bubbly. Neagle's cinematic legacy, marked by her iconic portrayal of Queen Victoria in Victoria the Great and Queen of Destiny, aligns with Faye Compton's roles in The Prime Minister and Poor Butterfly. Additionally, both actresses took on the character of Florence Nightingale, adding a unique connection to their careers. Neagle's enduring popularity, blending stage, and screen success solidifies her as a trailblazer in English cinema, commander of the most excellent order of the British Empire, and later elevated to Dame Commander. Anna Neagle's contributions to drama were officially recognized in the 1952 King's New Year's Honors list and the 1969 Queen's New Year Honors List, respectively. Beyond the accolades, Neagle's cinematic prowess earned her the title of international top box office actress multiple times in the late 1940s and early 1950s. Notably, her film Victoria the Great clinched the Venice Film Festival Gold Cup of All Nations in 1937. While Spring in Park Lane and Odette received the prestigious Daily Mail National Film Award in 1949, and 1952. Moreover, Neagle's remarkable stage endurance is etched in the Guinness Book of World Records. Her role in Charlie Girl spanned an impressive 2,062 consecutive performances from 1965 to 1971, showcasing her commitment to the craft. These accomplishments, from prestigious awards to enduring stage feats, underscore Anna Neagle's lasting impact on the world of entertainment. A trailblazer recognized by the highest honors, her legacy transcends the silver screen. As we bid adieu to this journey through the captivating world of cinema, let's pause and reflect on the indelible mark left by an extraordinary talent. The ethereal performances of the luminary actress linger in our memories, inviting you to share the tapestry of emotions woven by her on-screen brilliance. In the realm of storytelling, Anna Neagle transcended mere acting she became a conduit for the human experience. Her cinematic endeavors were more than scenes played out on celluloid. They were mirrors reflecting our joys, sorrows, and the nuanced shades of our existence. Perhaps, in the dim glow of a movie theater or the comfort of your living room, you found solace in her portrayals, a resonance that transcended time and space. Now, as the curtains draw to a close, your narrative becomes integral. How has the enchanting world of Anna Neagle intersected with your own? What scenes linger in the recesses of your memory, echoing the symphony of emotions only she could evoke? This is an invitation to share, to connect, and to celebrate the enduring legacy she has bequeathed to the world of entertainment. Your reflections become the tributaries of a collective homage, enriching the mosaic of admiration for a talent that touched hearts across generations. Share your thoughts, your cherished moments, and the ineffable impact that this cinematic luminary has had on your own narrative. In this communal act of remembrance, we celebrate not only a gifted actress, but the shared experiences that unite us in the appreciation of art. Thank you for embarking on this reflective journey with us, for contributing your unique chapter to the ongoing story of Anna Neagle's influence on the cinematic tapestry. Gratefully, 